Hello, colleagues, and welcome back to Viva Barca. Welcome to another interesting episode where we are going to be discussing on some interesting updates. We start with Frank Kissier, as it has been reported that Premier League giants Liverpool have zero interest in the 35 million euro rated Barca midfielder. Of course, this comes after reports emerged earlier today that Liverpool are one of the strongest contenders to sign the midfielder. We are going to be discussing on that as we progress. Then secondly, talking about Lionel Messi, as FC Barcelona have almost ruled out Messi's return as Inter Miami are best place to sign him now. So guys, as we get right into the full stories, please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. If you're just coming across the channel for the very first time, you are highly welcome. Consider liking the video and please watch the video right up to the very end. Amid speculations that Liverpool were looking at Barca midfielder Frank Kessier as a target for the summer transfer window, James Pies of the Athletic newspaper has come up with an update on the matter and as per his report, the Premier League giants have zero interest in the 26-year-old Barca star Frank Kessier. Kessier joined Barca in the summer of last year arriving from AC Milan after his contract had expired there. While he was far from being a regular starter under Xavi Hernandez at Camp Nou this season, the Ivory Coast International made some valuable contributions over the course of his debut season. But given Barcelona's need to sell, Frank Isi is one of three players who the club are actively trying to offload in the summer. While he had been initially reluctant to leave, reports earlier today suggested that the former AC Milan star has accepted his fate and he is willing to depart in the summer. And the Catalan giants are hoping to make at least 35 million euros from his sale. Reports in Spain earlier this week suggested that Liverpool would be willing to pay such a sum to sign Frank Kessier. However, the aforementioned report dismisses those claims stating that Jurgen Klopp's rights have zero interest in the Barcelona star. The 26-year-old does not even feature on the summer shopping shortlist of the Premier League heavyweights. While Liverpool may not be the in the race, Frank Kese continues to attract interest from Inter Milan. However, the Nerazzurri are not in a position to spend that heavy and would prefer player exchange operations something that might not appeal a great deal to Barca. So, it remains to be seen how the La Liga champions are able to resolve the future of Frank Kessier, with Liverpool not in the picture of his signing as things stand. Of course, Frank Kessier's future has made headlines today. Of course, as rumors have been saying that Frank Kessier have accepted to leave Barca, if need be, after Xavi have convinced him to explain things to him about the economic situation of the club and the need for some important sales. And we know Frank Kizzi have not had the best of seasons. Um, when we talk about playing time, it has not been coming for him because, you know, the, the players ahead of him in the pecking order are Xavi's top choices, the likes of Frankie de Jong, Pedri, Gavi, Busquets. It has been very difficult for Frank Kizzi to have that game time. Not like he has had any bad performance. Whenever given the chance, Frank Kessie have tried his best to ensure that he lived up to the mark. In the absence of Pedri with injury, in the absence of Frankie de Jong in the course of this last season, we saw Frank Kessie putting, putting on some very good displays. And it is quite unfortunate, I think, that Frank Kessie have not been able to stay much longer and have accepted that he really wants to leave. If Barca really want to push him out, he will leave if that will help the club's finances and so on and so forth. So there were interests from Liverpool, Tottenham, Manchester United, um, Inter Milan most especially as recent reports were claiming and of course Liverpool being one of those clubs have recently said they have no interest whatsoever in Frank Kese, contradicting those reports earlier. So, Frank Kese, no matter that Liverpool are not interested, is still strongly linked to other bigger clubs like Inter Milan, you know, and so on and so forth. Tottenham Hotspur also showing interest. 
So I think Barcelona won't lack a suitor. But the fact is, the money, the 35 million euros that they have placed on Franchise's head, might just be a problem, you know, because he has not played much games for those clubs to be like, wow, well, yeah, he had a good season. He has not had that big opportunities this season under Xavi's tutelage. But I think everybody should know Franchise is a top, top midfielder. Because we saw the likes of his performances, especially in AC Milan, where his prime of his career were there, where he was one of the key players there, what a midfielder he is. And I think he can future as a starting 11 player for any big club in Europe. Any big club in Europe. He has that capability. He's such a magnificent midfielder, very physical. He has some good attributes that many clubs would like in their roster. Even though Xavi Hernandez had his own plans. And I think that Frank Casey, you know, leaving the club, sporting-wise, it doesn't make sense. But when we look at the economic point of view, it surely makes sense, don't it? Because Barca needs to have a good transfer window. And if they don't do sales, how can we do that? We can't have a good window. Then on to the final story of discussion. In a major blow for FC Barcelona supporters, um, Roger Torello of Mundo Deportivo is reporting that Barca have almost ruled out the signing of club legend Lionel Messi as they admit it is very difficult to make the transfer happen. Messi's future has been in talk of the town for a long time as links to Barca, Saudi Arabia's Ali Lal and Inter Miami of the MLS continue to persist. Chances of a return to Barca look very likely after Messi's father and agent, George Messi, had a meeting with club president Juan Laporta at the latter's residence earlier this week. However, the lack of a formal offer from the Blaugrana is seemingly causing concerns within the Argentines' camp. Even though Barca have received La Liga's approval over their economic viability plan, the club need to execute it and make some sales to guarantee Messi signing and registration. As such, the La Liga champions are not all that optimistic about their chances to bring the seven-time Ballon d'Or winner back to the club. Sources from within the entity have told Mundo Deportivo that signing Messi at this point is very difficult. Instead, Inter Miami are understood to be the best place to sign him in the summer. The MLS outfit are not only proposing a lucrative contract for Messi, but are also offering a percentage of profit from their major partners Adidas and Apple, while also giving him the option of buying a stake in the club once his player career is over. A decision from Messi and his scam could arrive soon and as things stand, it seems like the former Barca captain is slipping away from the Catalan's grasp and could end up in the United States of America come July. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.